Welcome to the Bharatiya Vidya Bhavan, the Bhavan, home of Indian arts. ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ಭಗವತಿ ನಿಶೇಷ ಜಾಡ್ಯ ಅಪಹ ಓಂ ಸರಸ್ವತ್ಯ ನಮಃ ನೌ ಆಲ್ ದ ಗುರು ರಿಮೆಂಬರ್ ಯುವರ್ ಓನ್ ಗುರು ಓಂ ಗುರು ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಗುರು ವಿಷ್ಣು ಗುರು ದೇವೋ ಮಹೇಶ್ವರ ಗುರು ಸಾಕ್ಷಾತ್ ಪರಂ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ತಸ್ಮೈ ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರವೇ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಗುರುರ್ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಗುರುರ್ವಿಷ್ಣು ಗುರು ದೇವೋ ಮಹೇಶ್ವರ ಗುರು ಸಾಕ್ಷಾತ್ ಪರಂ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ತಸ್ಮೈ ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರವೇ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ನಮಸ್ವೀ ಹೋಲ್ ಸ್ಲೋಲಿ ಓಂ ಗಣಾನಂತ ಗಣಪತಿ ಗುಂಹವಾಮಹೆ ಕವಿಂಕವೀನಾಮುಪಮಶ್ಲೋಲಿ ಕವಿಂಕವೀನಾಮುಪಮಶ್ರಭಸ್ತಮ ಜ್ಯೇಷ್ಠರಾಜ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮಣ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮಣಸ್ಪತ ಆನಶೃಣ್ವನ್ನೋತಿಭಿಸ್ಸೀದ ಸಾಧನ Good evening everyone. I am Ratnam Tadwarti, maternal uncle of Tanvi. I come... It's too far. Okay. Can you hear me okay? Too far? Yeah, I think I'll help you. Good evening everyone. I am Ratnam Tadwarti, the maternal uncle of Tanvi. Accompanied by Nirupama behind the screen for accompanying... on the song descriptions we are honored to be comparing the arangetram of kumari tanvi today vichesan vidwansulaku srotalaku namaskaram andarki suswagatam let's welcome the artists on the stage get settled down and give them a round of applause while we are at it <laughs> we welcome our chief guest padma shri dr john mar and mrs wendy mar <laughs> and also like to welcome our guests of honor for today mr and mrs nandakumara and mrs ann wilcox and thank them for joining us we extend our warm acknowledgments to the guests friends elders who have come from far off places and even farther continents in some cases to start off a welcome note by aparna and funny satyaraj Thank you. 
Good evening, friends. Carnatic music means different things to different people. It's an art form, it's worship, it's a therapy, and it's a culture. Even within our family, everyone had their own personal connection with various classical art forms. But over the past several years, it has given something special to our family. As in the reality, with many pan-Indian families with several languages, accents, food habits, subcultures spread across three, four generations, we too deal with constant recalibration and re-education, just like you would see in any international team of delegates. Out of all this diversity, Carnatic music truly brought all of us together. Elders spending hours listening to the kids singing, kids getting introduced to hidden game, jumps by elders, we catching a breath in the meantime. So, Carnatic music and the classical music have bought a common line and gave us a wholesome lifestyle. We stand here, humbled in the pleasant shadow of hundreds of years of legacy, welcoming you all to our daughter's Arangetram. We hope you enjoy the evening and shower your blessings on her. Thank you. And now, a little note by the little sister. Come. <laughs> I'll hold it. Hello, everybody. Namaste. I am Sri Tvesha, Tanvi's sister. And today is my sister's Arangetram. She has been practicing every single day. Akka is the best sister, and she she helps me with my recorder but we also but we also fight sometimes <laughs> anyway i am so excited because my sister is great at singing and she is also doing an arangetram good luck akka thank you <laughs> So for today's program, introducing the artists, we have Sri K. Sivaraman from Chennai on violin. <laughs> Sri N. Ramakrishnan on Mridangam. <laughs> Sri N. Sundar on Morsing. <laughs> Sri N. Rajaraman on Ghatam. <laughs> and Kumari Shangari a senior disciple of Sri Sivasakti Sivanesan on Tambura. <clears throat> the force, the reason, the motivation, and more precisely, the guru, Sri Mati Sivasakti Sivanesan, who forged and introduced scores of artists under her care and instruction, we bow before you and give you our deepest respects. Even though she couldn't join us today, she sends her best regards to the dignitaries, artists, guests, and more importantly, Tanvi Satiraj. Now, on to the much-awaited performance of the day. We can print dim the lights. <clears throat> the first two songs, Nera Namiti and Sri Ganesha Charanam. Nera Namiti is a Varnam set in Kannada Ragam derived from Karahar Priya Janyam set to Atatalam, a work of Sri Poochi Srinivasa Iyengar venerating Lord Vishnu. Following that, a respectful invocation of Ganesha, the remover of obstacles in Sri Ganesha Charanam set in Thilang Ragam, a Janya of Harikamboji in Aditalam.
opening songs the next two pieces are marugelara and parvati ninu saint tyagaraja preaches lord rama in his marugelara as the sole reason for the existence of everything and calls for his protection in his glorious work set in jayantishri ragam of natabhairavi janya in deshadi talam 
After that comes the melodious Parvati Nino from the Trinity Sri Shama Shastri. He wonders why there is a delay in the deliverance by Goddess Parvati. This is said to Kalgada Ragam, Janya of Gayaka Priya in Aditalam Tisrajati. I'm gonna 
بابا
amazing rendition by the ensemble on the stage for the main concert piece. Sorry we had to apologize for the surprise thrown our way on the projection system and we made sure that we won't be having any more of the distraction today. While more, there's more coming our way of the years in mind, we would like to take a few minutes to hear from the today's guests, today's guests of honor. We request our Dr. Nandakumara to say a few words about today's evening. Let's welcome him onto the stage.
Namaste, Namaskaram. Friends, let's give a big hand to these unique accompanying artists who have been supporting our dear, dear Tanvi all this while. Such profound artists. <laughs> Amidst all these wonderful artists, our Tanvi is shining like a star. Later, our chief guest, Padma Shri, Dr. Jan Mar, will be speaking, and then he will be talking about the various uh, aspects of uh, today's concert. So I won't take uh, uh, much time uh, in dwelling on that because he's an expert. Dr. Mar is someone who we all know that is one of the finest scholars in this part of the world who knows more about our art and culture than many of us. Friends, I'm so happy to be part of this unique concert today. I would like to thank our dear Tanvi's parents, Sri and Srimati Satiraju, for inviting all of us here. Our Shiva Shakti ji, if she were here, she would have felt really, really proud of the singing of her brilliant student, young student, throughout, without uh, even in a minute of rest, with such Shruti Baddham, she has sung enthralling all of us. And we miss Shiva Shakti. We miss our dear Shiva Shakti. I still remember a year ago when our Tanvi's parents came to my office, when the date was fixed for her Arangetram, I remember. Since then, she has grown in the field of our Carnatic music, and so ably she has handled the whole situation so beautifully. Tanvi, thank you so much. <laughs> Friends, Shiva Shakti Ji, I would like to talk about our Shiva Shakti Ji. Shiva Shakti Ji, started teaching here at the Bhavan in the early 80s, to be precise, in 1983. For over three decades, she has been teaching, training a number of students in the field of both Carnatic vocal and Veena, and also she has taught some of them even the way of singing to dance performances. A very dedicated teacher, very committed uh, guru, and somebody who loved who likes, who loves her children, as her, uh, her students, as her own children. And her contribution to our bhavan is immeasurable. And we would like to uh, remember the contribution of Shiva Shakti in her absence here. She should be back in a week's time, back in her class, conducting, uh, uh, taking various classes. But I would like to remember how beautifully she has served the field of our Carnatic arts, Carnatic music, vocal, veena, and also our dance. She has sung for virtually every <coughs> dance arangetram of our Prakashji here. Always we are very grateful to all our teachers for their contribution to bring our children to such a unique standard where they can come and sit on the stage and enthrall all of us. Dear friends, I see many new faces here. In the bhavan, we try and do our best to generate interest amongst youngsters towards our great art, music, dance, drama, yoga, languages, and you name them. All those subjects are taught under one roof, under the able guidance of none other than Padma Shri Dr. Janmar, who is the chairman of our education subcommittee also. Only yesterday, we started our new term. Our open day was yesterday. Tasted classes were held. Many new students have joined. Many more are going to join soon. Please do tell your friends, those who are interested, to learn 
our music, dance, drama, yoga and languages, there is a place here at the Bhavan where all the teachers are waiting to impart their knowledge to the worthy students so that our future generation will cherish and feel proud about art. Thank you so much. Namaste. Thank you for the kind words. And now we request our next guest of honor, Mrs. Ann Wilcox, to say a few words. I'm delighted and honoured to be here today to say a few words on this very special day for Tanvi. Thank you so much for inviting me. At school, uh, Tanvi's high level of general musicianship shines through in her music studies. She works beautifully and creatively with her peers in practical work and has made such a positive contribution to group arrangements and compositions at school. Tanvi has learned and performed really quite challenging and ambitious repertoire as a young member of the senior choir, such as the Brahms German Requiem. She is impressively able to make use of the considerable skills she has acquired in her Carnatic studies in other contexts and performances too. Tanvi's teachers and her peer group have been delighted with her Carnatic singing in our annual year group music festival competition and the quality of Tanvi's music here today that I'm enjoying is absolutely astonishing. Thank you. <laughs> Tanvi is an extremely bright and highly capable and impressive student who excels in all areas of her studies at Henrietta Barnett School. Her teachers hugely value her highly positive disposition and her maturity. Tanvi is an excellent listener and she has a wonderful work ethic. Tanvi is also a calm, thoughtful and extremely kind young person. She is very caring and is always supportive of others and seeking to include everyone. Tanvi is a genuine pleasure to have as a student at the school. I have no doubt that she will continue to achieve great things in her music and otherwise, and I wish her all the very best for the future. Thank you. Thank you so much. Mrs. Cook, Principal of Henrietta Barnett School, sends her best wishes to Tanvi and expresses her regret for not being able to join us today. We thank you. We thank you for your esteemed presence and kind words. We are about the half mark of the concert and we'll continue with our journey. Thank you. Then we will present Samagana and Venkata Chalanilayam. In Samagana, Sri Lalita Dasar shows his love in true belief to the mother who can provide Sanjeevani Aushada, all the riches in the world. This Samagana is set in Hamsanandi Ragam, a Janya of Gamanashrama, set to Misra Chapu. Following that, Sri Purandara Dasa brings the splendor and beauty of the resident of Tirumala in Venkata Chala Nilaya to our eyes through his work in Sindhu Bhairava Raga, a Janya of Nataka Priya set in Aditalam. <laughs> Oh 
ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀಕಾಂತ 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 ಕಮಲನಯನ ಯೋಗಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸರ್ವಲೋಕೈಕನಾದ 
Pibare Ramarasam and Chakkani Talliki. A popular classic, Pibare Ramarasam, in which Sri Sadhasiva Brahmendra recommends us to imbibe the name of Lord Rama to free one from the cycle of birth and death. In Ahir Bhairavi Raga, a Janya of Chakravakam said to Aditalam. Then, Saint Talapaka Annamacharya, the 15th century Hindu saint from Andhra Pradesh, brings a high spirited and lively rendition, Chakkani Talliki Changupala, which illustrates the charming gestures of Alamelu Manga to her beloved Lord Venkatapati. This song is set in Padi Ragam, a Janya of Maya Malava Gaula in Aditalam. I'm 
combination of a soulful, soulful pibare ramarasam followed by the gleeful chakkani talliki changubala. Next is Tilana. The concluding composition in a concert is a brisk and lively rendition. Out of the popular variants available in this format, Tanvi brings us the work of Sri Lalgudi Jairaman set in Hamir Kalyani Raga in Adi Talam, second column.
Fantastic and exhilarating performance by Tanvi Satyaraju. He surely took our emotions for a ride this evening. Thank you so much to you and the, and the artists accompanying you. And another round of applause for the stage. <clears throat> With his glorious tenure and long patronage of arts and culture, Padma Shri Dr. John Marr the founding trustee and secretary of Bharati Avidya Bhavan bestowed many students and the, of the institution with his blessings and encouragement. As Dr. Nandakumar, the executive director of BVB, rightly pointed out, Dr. Mar's contributions are an indelible impression on this world and well known all the world over. Please welcome our chief guest to share his wisdom with us today. Friends, do excuse me, I haven't got to the stage of sitting on the stage. Our thanks, firstly, to Sri and Srimati Satiraju <clears throat> Aparna and Pani, for such a star as our Tanvi. How lucky we are. And to Tanvi I would say Bhagamanchidi. Yenta Thairiyamu, Yenta Bhagyamu. Bravery, 
fortitude, sheer strength of performance in the sad absence from our midst today of our dear Shiva Shakti, whom we all send our love and speedy recovery. Anandaji said, said it all about our Shiva Shakti. I have known her since she first came here and she is a star and has produced stars. What about Bhagyamu? Tanvi is lucky to have had such a brilliant team of supporting musicians. <laughs> to mention them, first of all, Sri Shivaraman, right here, whom personally I hadn't had the privilege of hearing before, but I did meet and know fairly well many years ago, Sri T. M. Krishnan. And uh, so, uh, in a way, I wasn't surprised by the brilliance of what we were going to hear. Sri Ramakrishnan. Our son, our son James said the best thing. Stunning was the word he used. <laughs> Speaking, of course, in particular of your brilliance in the Tani Avartanam. So thank you. <laughs> Sri Raja Raman. Yes, we did get the athletics on the Ghatam in the end. I was waiting for it. But what a wonderful percussive accompaniment he provided. <laughs> Sri Sundar. What sounds to conjure from so tiny and simple an assemblage of pieces of metal. <laughs> Somewhat painful. I remember trying one once and decided that was definitely not for me. I've got it still at home somewhere, if I know where. But thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> Lastly, our dear Shangari. Shangari. is of course one of auntie, as we call her, auntie's chief senior students. And many years ago, like Tanvi later on, she had to put up with being jawed at by me. She is also uh, now a colleague, having taken over two of my theory classes now that she's finished her degree and covered herself with glory in the university. <laughs> I wasn't remotely surprised, friends, by what Tanvi's teacher said about her work at her school. Tanvi always struck me as a person of great commitment to whatever she was doing, varied in her interests. From time to time, uh, I would come into class and there she would be doing some uh, complicated work in physics or something else which was beyond my ken entirely.
and I think she's the only student at Bovern whom I can ever recall as having visited the D-Day beaches in Normandy some years ago. Uh, it does involve quite a rough passage sometimes across the channel. Always interested, she even, having passed her post-diploma too, in theory and, and practical, she even came back for another year of the same, as though one year wasn't enough. Dogged persistence in all she does. We are so lucky, friends, to have such a rising star in our midst. Her teacher spoke of her choir work at school. Now that doesn't surprise us either. My son James, who does our Christmas carol concert every year, conducts uh, our students. I think the first year, Tanvi, that you were here, he said, what a wonderfully strong voice that little girl has got. She was little in those days, but a strong voice. And if we needed any proof of that, what have we not heard this evening? What have we not seen of and heard of her range in all three styles, particularly, I would say, the Mandra style and the Tara style? A purity of tone that is exemplary. Coming to the program itself, I have to jog a bad memory. Sri Ganesha Charanam, beautifully sung. She had by then got thoroughly into her idiom and we knew from then on we were in for a treat. Marugelara of Tyagaraja, how brilliantly she handled the fact that there are at least 11 variations, Sangatis, in the Pallavi. <laughs> and I don't think, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, I don't think she missed any of them out. And maybe she put one or two Manodharma ones of her own in too, uh, also, which is, of course, one of the things that one learns to do, uh, Lakshya Jnanam as distinct uh, from Lakshana Jnanam. That, that also. Creative, creativity, in other words. Parvati Nino, Shama Sastri was a master of tala, of complicated rhythms and doing things not quite like anybody else. And okay, Tisranade um, Adi, yes, we've heard it before from other people, but how catching and beautifully performed it was, on the rhythmic side as well as on the melodic side. Then Parvati... Nayakane. Uh, sorry. Parvati Nayakane. Naya, sorry. Uh, Parvati Nayakane. I should have remembered that one because, in fact, on my 70th birthday at our house, dear auntie sang that piece uh, on our small stage uh, and I remember it very well and I've probably got pictures of it somewhere. It was, it was and is, I guess, one of auntie's favourite pieces and it was so wonderfully handed on to us by her dear sister right here. 
Particularly uh, pleasing was her excursion into Nirabal, melodic improvisation. I do have to say, my favorite form of Lakshyanyanam. She handled them beautifully, one after the other, and she was in no hurry. Did you not hear how the slower tempo swaras unfolded? Too many musicians are sort of in a hurry to get on to the really catchy bits. They don't dwell upon all the possibilities that are there. And that restraint as a true artist is what you showed. The percussion, the Tanya Vratanam, of course, for itself, was, I guess, worth traveling many miles to hear. And we don't have to do nine hours or whatever to Chennai or to Bangalore, sorry, Bengaluru, uh, uh, <laughs> to hear such performances. We can sit back here, especially at my age, when travel insurance would cost a bomb, sit here and hear the finest Carnatic music that the present young generation and their elders are producing because be under no doubt that for the future Carnatic music is safe in such hands. And yes, I'm sorry, mouths in the case uh, of, um, of um, uh, Murasing. So we just got lucky. Tanvi's range came out particularly in Venkatachala Nilayam, a beautiful piece. And I was so glad to hear someone's uh, composition, someone who's been fairly neglected until quite recently, that's Tala Parker on the Macharya, who has... Um, a curious fact about him is that his compositions, many of them, are on what we call in uh, Tamar, Seperda, that is copper plate, like copper plate grants. And so they were indestructible. It wasn't a question of them being copied and copied and copied and getting them slightly wrong one time after another um, so that you diverge from the original. No, we have got the real thing. And thank goodness, I think, correct me if I'm wrong, Aparna, but there is a revival of his work in Andhra and not before time, may I say. Finally, the Tilana. Now here again, people are, oh, this is, a, this is the last one. I better speed up. I better do this, that, and the other. No. Tanvi did not. She held herself in almost deliberately. She didn't go galloping away uh, as some musicians do. I'm sure we've all noticed that. But there's a saying in Latin, festina lente, make haste slowly. And this lesson in, in spades, ladies and gentlemen, is what our Tandi has taught us today. Thank you. By our performance with our Mangalam.
Aparna and I would like to extend our deepest appreciation to all the uh, um, our parents, especially who have travelled from India. Sri uh, Satyaraj Vijay Lakshmi Garu, Mana Mamagaru, Mariu Mamoy Garu, Sri Tatwarth Venkateswar Rao Garu, Varbari Sri Ganga Bhavani Garu, Maurade Purak Sabha Kangshal Delpchunno, Varshe Dr. Margar ki Puraskar and Valskindi ka Korchunno. Sorry. Now, welcome the special person of the day who has kept us engaged with her amazing vocals, Chiranjeevi Tanvi, for her speech of thanks. Um, I'm here to say thank you to everyone who's made this event possible. So, first of all, thank you to my teacher, um, who I fondly call auntie. Unfortunately, she's unable to be here, but I owe everything to her. Um, she's guided me throughout this process um, and corrected my mistakes with diligence and care, and I am eternally grateful to her. Um, to all the accompanying artists who, who have been so supportive during the rehearsals and... Um, and they've, and they've encouraged me so much in the absence of auntie. And just being in their presence is an honor. And they've come all the way from India. They're so experienced. And it's, <clears throat> it's, a ple it's an honor to um, have sung and had them accompany me. And to all the people behind the scenes who have made this program a success, and like the lighting, the sound, and my uncle for comparing. So thank you to that. And most importantly, to all of the audience for being here. Um, thank you for coming and taking the pains to grace the occasion. And um, I'm so honored to have you bless me for the concert. So thank you. Such a sweet yet mature, mature gesture. Well done and all the best once again. In our special mention of the day, we would like to recognize the gracious presence of Mr. and Mrs. Prabhakar Kaja. You will say a few words. Actually, I saw Tanvi, or I heard Tanvi, about seven, eight years ago, I think, somewhere in Manchester. 
she was singing, I think, Govindashtakam. And she didn't get a single word and a single note wrong. It was absolutely perfect, so perfect that MS Balakshmi herself would have appreciated her. And I want to thank both her parents for encouraging her. And I think in another four years, she'll become the Young Artist Award in Music Academy Chennai. Yeah, of course. Yeah. <laughs> All the best for her and her parents. Well done. Thank you. Thank you. Well, thanks. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Okay. Thanks. Oh, we're going one more to her. Better? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, <laughs> Anyway. <laughs> 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 Good. <laughs> Good. <laughs> For arranging the logistics for the artist's visa and travel. <laughs> now, we ca now we all can go to the dinner hall for having a feast. Thank you. <laughs>